uh, needs to be changed to the proper amount of the 1130, and that goes up by 5%. So this one needs to be 1130, and then this one's going to go up by 5% each period. Adjust by percent, 5%. Looks good. So it's compounding. So zero's got that nice functionality uh, allowing us to do those simple kind of mathematical functions for our formulas. So I can go, all right, what's next, man? This, I, this is easy. Interest uh, expense, interest expense. We're going to go back on over here and say, uh, where's the interest expense? Uh, there it is. So here's the interest expense. We're in Jan. So that's going to be the 334. 334. Now this one went down by a percent. So so it's taking so this I think this is designed uh, to do an increase. But I think I said down maybe I can make it a negative. It's going to go down by 5% because I took f uh, over here I said that I wanted it to to go be 95%. So that's a decrease of five percent let's try that out and see if it works so that would bring us to okay let's check check the total three oh six two three oh it's pretty close three oh six seven versus three. so i'm i'm gonna be okay with that it's a budget it's a budget uh so a little bit of uh as long as it's in the ballpark right as long as it's in the ballpark all right, so this one, we didn't do anything for this one. And then this one, uh, the cost of goods sold, 22977. So let's go into the cost of the goods that are sold. Where, how come it's not 22? We need to be back in January. 22977. 22977. That one goes up by the same amount as the sales line because it should be relational. So that's uh, one uh, goes up by 10%. So I'm going to say percentage increase. 10 percentages on the increase. And that totals up to 491361. So let's just double check that. 491361. All right, it's close. And so we're going to say bank uh, service charges is just going to be the same so these should be easy going forward from here so we're going to say other income where's my expenses bank service charges which we called don day there's our don day where are they oh they're bank bank charges january this is 18 and we can just copy that one across just do the same thing apply a fixed amount boom all the way across i'm not even going to check it because that one should be easy and then we have the insurance this is the one where we said we just applied it uh weirdly in the middle kind of on a cash basis because that's when we're going to pay it so we're going to say insurance uh insurance right here we said six thousand in feb and six thousand in i think september we said it was for a total of 12,000 on the year that we're gonna pay, right here and September, all right? Wages, wages, we're gonna put in the good old wages, how much we're paying the employees. We don't wanna have an uprising from the staff because we don't have any money to pay them or something. So three, six, nine, eight, three, three. So I'm gonna say six, nine, eight three three now this whoa hold, hold on a second hold on a second that's six nine eight three uh that's too much six nine eight three okay and this one we we changed it like in the middle those union contracts getting out of control there for a second but so we need to change it in july so i'm going to first copy it across and so i'm going to say copy that across and then in July, I'm going to make the change. I'm going to say in July, 
we'll just dollar amount the change, 7682 right there, 7682. And then I'm gonna copy it across from here, copy it across from there, boom. And then that comes out to 87990. And over here, we've got 87990, MUI B to the NBN. Let's do a similar thing with the payroll taxes. Payroll, the government wants their stuff as well. I'm more scared of them than the employees even. And the employees terrify me. Payroll tax expense. Let's say this is gonna be uh, 486, same thing, it changes like in the middle. So I'm gonna say 486, copy that across. And then in, uh, in July, they increased it. In July, they increased it. So July, uh, 535. I'm more scared of the staff than, than Disney is scared of their staff for crying out loud. And that's, that's saying something. They're good staffs. Dang employees have gotten out of control. No, okay. <laughs> We're going to say this comes over here at the 6126. Six, All right. And then next we've got the utilities. Uh, 634, 634, and so utilities will say 634, and we just copy that across, same amount all the way across, por favor, please, and then the telephone, 385, copying it across, 385, 385, 385, I'll just copy that across. Just do it all the way across. We're almost there. We only get to do two more and then we have to stop. So enjoy the last two because this is all you get. Uh, internet 90. Internet. Internet 90. Uh, I don't want the 90s internet. That's when it was slow. These are, okay, apply it across. And then we're gonna say supplies expense is going to be 350 350 for the supplies we're almost there muy cerca very close to completion of the project 350 350 but i don't want it to end because it's the good times depreciation uh one two three six one two three six depreciation depre one two three six copy it across one two three six and one more last one make it last people get full enjoyment from this one this is it miscellaneous miscellaneous uh 75 75 oh yeah that was a good data input right there okay so then we can check our totals uh, down below. These are the total expenses and the net profit. So we can kind of tie out our net profits here. Notice something looks like it's off in February. So I think something is, is a little off here. I'm not gonna go through the checking because we're gonna we'll com continue to do that next time. I'll actually generate the reports. Let's go ahead and save it. And then we'll see how we can go back in here and make adjustments if there's any, if there's any errors. But we could check the numbers down here but if we were to save the reports and generate the actual reports and there was an error there, we can always go back into it, which again, we will check out in a following presentation.